Hello, everyone. My name is Paul Salenza. It's very exciting to speak to you today. I'm a very big believer in vocational education and I've seen the benefits that it has on people throughout their working lives. What we'll do first, I'll go through some short courses um, and some vocational training. And I'll also hand you over to Cameron Grill, who's our group training coordinator, just to touch base on the group training that we offer. So I've been here, I've been in EIT for um, almost 12 years. So I've seen a lot of different sort of courses and students throughout my time. It's been a really exciting experience. Just to touch, just to start off on the professional certificate of competency courses. Essentially they're uh, three month courses and they handle or they deal with um, specific sort of niche engineering um, areas. So there might be, for example, an area in your um, in your organization, maybe you're um, weaker or you need more knowledge or skills in a specific area. That's what these professional certificate of competencies are for, right? And it really could be anything. They're quite, a lot of them are very, very niche. But what they do is they take you through on a, over a three month period, um, different parts of sort of a specific engineering area that you that you need that you need to learn a little bit about. So we'll talk a little bit about initially about the structure. So the structure, as I said, it is a um, three month course. And inside that three months, you'll have a webinar every two weeks. Right now, the webinars last for approximately 90 minutes, it depends on how many questions the students have. Uh, but you look looking at about 90 minutes for um, each webinar. There's 12 different modules in each professional certificate of competency course that handles, uh, takes you through a specific sort of area, depending on the, the nature of the course that you're looking at. One of the things we pride ourselves on, there's a few different things, but the webinars, we have live webinars. So essentially what we do is we link up the students and the instructor in real time similar to what we're doing right now right um and so it's not a, it's not a video on the internet or anything like that it's it's you're, you're actually speaking in real time to an instructor the other thing we sort of pride ourselves on is that we have um not just academics we have instructors that have been in industry these are people that have been where you are um and they're they, they've got many, many, many years of experience. They're also highly qualified, as you would expect. But they're here, they're there to sort of, they're, it's great because they're, you're able to ask them sort of any questions that you kind of have, anything that you're not sure about, and they'll guide you through the professional certificate of competency course to make sure that you, 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 you understand, you have a full understanding of, of what's being delivered. We use a learning management system called Moodle. Now Moodle is highly customized to suit our delivery style. And on that, it's on Moodle, it's, it's available for you uh, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, right? So, and then what that does is it's essentially a website on the, on the net that has all of the information that you, that you need for your course. You, you could imagine that if we were to email you your readings and your slides, uh, you know, all your assessments, your inbox would get very, very, very cluttered very quickly. So we don't do that. What we do is we put everything up onto our learning management system Moodle, and then um, students access that um, whenever they, all the time, right? It's our, you, would, you could say it's our major communication tool. It's very user-friendly, it's easy to use, doesn't take very long to sort of understand how to use it at all. But on that, you'll have your all of the different sort of resources that you need for your course. You'll have your slides, you'll have your assessments, all of your reading materials, all the schedules, all of um, the remote lab information, everything you kind of need for your course will be there, right? In order to and what you'll do is essentially is work your way through that the course over the three month period, right? Now we do offer support. I mentioned one of the things I mentioned before was the um, instructors, the highly experienced and highly qualified instructors that are taking you through all of the 
academics, all of the um, engineering type things, the technical part of the course. That's what they're there for. They help you with your understanding on the on the area of the of of, of engineering that you're currently studying. What we also do is have a team of highly trained and highly skilled professionals, um, and we call them learning support officers. Right now, they're they're not engineers; they're administrative people. But there, it's one port of call. Someone that if you if there's something happening that um, you're not sure what to do, there's one person that you can contact, and they will know all that. They will know which intake you're in, where which course you're in, where that course has progressed over time, where you're up to, um, any, any, anything really at all that you need, the learning support officer is there to, to respond and to help you. So you never feel alone with, with your course, right? There's always a number of people that, can, that will help you and guide you and support you right along the way. We have a number of different courses the types we've got um, really um, any kind of engineering that you can kind of think of we have um, a, a professional certificate of competency course that can assist you right so um, we're always developing new ones and we've got a we've got a huge range of different um, professional certificate of competency courses um, that we that we provide to students all the time and these courses are hugely popular with students all around the world. We often have students doing uh, multiple courses. They'll do a course and then they'll do another course. These professional certificate of competency courses are also very good if you, for example, already have a, um, a qualification of some kind, right? Um, maybe um, you don't wanna spend years doing another qualification. What you really want is just to keep your knowledge and your your skills up and so that you, logging so joining one of our professional certificate of competency courses gives you that extra sort of uh, professional knowledge that you kind of need to keep make sure that your your skills and your knowledge is is that is that is that is always at the at, at the fourth at the top end of of of, industry, of best practice in industry we provide the courses in a very cost effective way so i think that you'll find that the fees are um, they're, they're, they're reasonable um, for the for the amount of uh, for the um, for the quality of the course, um, and the, all the fees are located on the um, on the web on the website for the students for any for anyone to view. I will also mention just in terms of the in terms of the the resources. Every um, module that you have, there'll be a readings guide for you. There'll be readings provided that are specifically tailored to the individual module that you're currently you're studying at that point in time. Those readings are take you through all of the you know the bits and pieces of that module. We also provide four um, of our ebooks to the students in the course, so you can take away and and go into some into some into more depth. Um, should you wish to do so, so those 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 um, those reading resources are, are fantastic. They've been developed at EIT over many 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 years, um, and they are um, they are at a very 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 high quality, which is which is really pleasing. And we often get feedback from students that the um, the readings are of a very high quality because we we have a, a whole team that is designated to um, providing proper solid reading materials for all of the students. There is a lot more to, to talk about um, with the professional certificates of competency courses, but the um, what we'll do now, we'll go into, let me just um, clean my screen clear. Just doing a, just clicking a couple of buttons now, which is annotate, sweet. Okay, um, one moment while I just, uh, there we go. Cameron, can you just switch the screen? Mine there seems to be a bit stuck. Okay. 
Okay. Sure. Over here, we've got um, just some of our more popular sort of professional certificate of competency courses. Um, we have, um, as I said before, like a huge range of the professional certificate of competency courses. But these are the ones that um, generally, uh, um, when we, whenever we sort of really, whenever we sort of schedule them, um, they're, they're, they're lots and lots of students enroll into them. First one is the professional certificate of competency in program, programmable logic controllers, PLCs and SCADA systems. It's probably, it's most, it's, that's our, our most popular course. Again, in the same in the industrial automation, you've got the professional certificate of competency in instrumentation, automation and process control. We've got safety instrumentation there for process industries and some civil courses as well. The, the professional certificate of competency in fundamentals of, of road construction. The next one is a course which is is relatively new, but we have found there's is huge demand for it, um, and and this and the feedback provided by students that have completed these courses is, is really 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 positive. It's a professional certificate of competency in big data and analytics in the electricity grid. A lot of electrical type courses as well. One of the examples is the um, electrical engineering professional certificate of competency in power distribution. And the big catch, phrase, catch word at the moment is hydrogen, the professional certificate of competency in hydrogen, energy, production, delivery, storage, and use. Do you see the, all of the, see the, the titles are very specific and, and really do tell you um, what is, what, 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 what will be covered. We've also got a, on our website, a very detailed um, description on each course and each module, um, what, what, the, what we'll go through in each course. Now, in order to, um, to successfully complete the course, students will need to spend five to eight hours a week on their study. So if you, you need to be able to allocate five to eight hours a week. Um, and if you can do that, then they're, they're, a great, um, they're a great choice in terms of um, studies to further your knowledge and understanding in specific areas. In order to complete the course, we have a few requirements. One is that, um, there's six quizzes. So, the, so as I said before, there's six webinars. So after every webinar, you'll have a quiz to complete. So the quiz, you, students will need to complete the quizzes. Students, there are also two assignments. So the assignments, one of the, the first assignment will be um, due, uh, um, that will, will cover the first half of the module, sorry, first half of the course, and it was due after the first half of the course has been delivered and the second one covers the second, the second assignment covers the second half of the course. We also have a webinar requirement. So students need to have attended 70% um, of the live webinars in order to, in order to um, complete, to be provided with the certificate at the end of the, of the course. All right. That's a bit of a, a bit of a rundown on the professional certificate of certificate of competency courses. Um, I'll hand it over to you now, Cameron.